Oh, sure. Yeah, this is a black knight that we got in. Uh, I think it was a previous customer, maybe bought it back at a Como store many, many years ago, and he was moving. Decided he didn't want it anymore. Hey, we picked it up for a good price, but we can see the play field's actually in real nice shape. I'm going to remove this glass here okay, so we can see it a little bit better. Uh, bubble wrap on the floor. It's a mess in here, you know. But anyways, yeah, the play field's actually in pretty nice shape. It doesn't have any MagnaSave wear at all. Uh, bright, vivid colors, and uh, it'll clean up real nice. We'll get some drop target stickers and uh, rebuild the flippers, uh, LEDs, and so forth. Uh, we can look at the back glass here. It's probably locked. So nope, actually yeah, it's okay. not. Oh, there it's you not, go. Yep, it's not locked. So. Watch out for the shooter rod. There you go. And let's uh, take a look at that. Oh, ouch. That's yeah. all right. That's all right though. Mm. Yeah, I mean it doesn't. It doesn't look too bad from the front, but I'm gonna get a new one. Yeah. I'm gonna get a new one from uh, uh, Classic Playfield Reproduction. So if you're looking back here, we got our displays. Oh, they all are they matching? They all match. Yeah. Oh, which wow. is surprising, but. They're, I mean, they're aged a little bit, but they still show the score, I'm sure. So, uh, if you look in the back here. Oh, no acid. Yep. Nice, clean board set. Uh, Do those match too? <laughs> uh, 28, four, six, it's kind of hard to tell. Four, four, six, five, three. And that's a four, five, six, five, three. That's a four, five, six, five, three. Yeah. There's a four, six, five, three, three, eight. Well, they, they just wrote it. They all, they yeah. all match. Yeah. yeah. They, they all do match. That's really clean. Wow. Yep. yep. So it's a very, uh, yeah, it's a clean board set. So we'll put an NVRAM in here. And uh, you can see that these fuse updates have been done here. Uh, to, you always want to fuse these bridges. So if you got, got an old Williams games, you always want to put a fuse in line with the bridge. If you don't do that and the bridge shorts, it'll burn your wiring harness and your transformer will ruin it. So, But uh, this will be a nice uh, game when it's done. I'm not going to, don't think I'm going to sell it because I can't find pinball machines anymore. So. <laughs> Uh, do we? I, I see another one. I haven't seen this since I've been here. It's been about a week since I have been here. I see a Joker's head. Is, is the is the uh, cabinet around too? I know. Is that, we can look at that one later if need be. Yeah, the, I'm excited for the Star Trek though to get this one set up and playing. I haven't played one of these in years. There's a Star Trek over here and here's a Joker's over here. Oh, it's, it's, it's right in front of me. I walked right in, walked right past it. So uh, I got the Joker's here and I just got the ramps back for the Joker's. Okay. Uh, we can take a look here, and uh, I haven't even looked at these yet. These are from, uh, I think, uh, brand new ramps for Jokers. Got the old ramps. I actually had to cut one to make it fit because uh, I wanted to save on postage. So they sent me the new ramps back, and uh, we got a nice, nice new ramp for the front. Uh, I can take it out of the package here. It's actually, it's kind of getting there pretty good, but I'm not going to take it out right now. But anyway, we got the other ramps here. They they actually transferred the ramp over, or transferred the hardware over. Well, they uh, did that as a service. Yeah, yeah as a service. Oh, Twenty five dollars to do yeah. that. So on. they look nice. I think uh, they're going to look nice. Joker's is a really underrated game. Mm -hmm. uh, and a good sound on, good music. So I'm looking forward. That'll be another project that we'll work on too, as well. So did you get a kind of a shot of the? Yeah, let's take a. I haven't played one of these since you had your showroom open on Murray Avenue. But another DNR star. That's always. Pinball Inc. sent is sending us a new tray up here from Pinball Inc. And then over from Marco Specialties, I got another uh, cover for the ramp here as well. So that'll be replaced. I'm going to put all new micro switches in there because if I have that that tray or that uh, upper play field apart, the micro switches will be kind of marginal. Mm -hmm. So it's just best to put all new ones on there. And uh, so that should be coming the next couple days. New bumper caps, of course, actuators, and LEDs for all the flashers uh, to kind of cut. A lot of times those flashers on jokers, for whatever reason, they if a ball is kept in the shooter lane, it uh, they keep flashing and eventually they'll start melting the plastic if somebody just starts a game and they walk away from it. So we'll put LEDs in the and uh, all those flashers. So I'm looking forward to streaming. We were thinking about streaming this in the next few weeks. So we'll we got come a blackout. Uh, this one came in on trade and uh, it it's a nice shape. It's a nice game. Uh, drop targets a little dirty. Uh, the uh, switches, but they look. 
this play field actually clean up nice and uh, back glass is decent. It's a decent blackout. It's a mm -hmm. good game. So uh, it's uh, be the next one, one of the next ones to get worked on. So, but anyways, it kind of uh, kind of shows you what we're working on. All right. We'll look forward to seeing you on the stream. Uh, pinball outpost on Twitch. See you guys later.